station, uh -huh. and I had a car that needed tires and batteries all, <laughs> yeah. the, time. all yeah. the time. And so I sat down with him, and we worked out a deal. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> he gave me a new battery, yeah. and the only thing that I regret, I didn't hold up for some time. <laughs> Bob has bartered hey, for you. Yeah. Does he have to punch out? Yeah, he'll be all right. Um, uh, I had, we both had a mutual friend. We, I knew uh, this man and woman from church, and I had Lindsay, and sometimes if I had to do something or work late or something, they would babysit Lindsay. She was really a toddler at that time. And Warren worked with Billy Fuller. It was um, They worked together. And they decided to move, and they, they <coughs> called each of us separately to come over to their house and help them move. Mm -hmm. So I go over in here. I've got little Lindsay, and, and he come over there. And and I wasn't at all interested in him because I saw myself as being, um, old, number one, older. Yeah. Number two, I had a child. I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> I had a child, and I thought, well, you know, he needs, you know, when he, they, they kept sending us on errands together, and I would put Lindsay right between us every time. Every time I'd stick her right up between us. And um, um, so they ended up getting moved and stuff, and he started trying to call me. And he said, he'd come out to the car. I, I kept ignoring him, and he'd come out to the car when I was leaving. And he'd come out there, and I'd crack the window back. And I said, what do you want? And he says, I was going to ask you out on, on a date. And I said, well, just call me this weekend. Just call me over the weekend. Well, I, this was on Friday. I get home to my little place where I live, to Lindsay and I live, and the phone rang. I said, what in the world? I barely got in the door. And he said, this is Warren, and it's the weekend. <laughs> so we, we started dating a little bit, but I didn't want to give him, the, at first, the time of day because I just thought I, I had a, a family already. You know, I was already a family. And he needed, I said, you know, you're a nice boy and everything, and you're younger, and you just need to meet somebody in high school or something. You know? yeah. But he kept kind of pursuing and. Uh, we we got married about uh, nine months later. Maybe. Nine months later. There's a big story that goes with it, but it's too long. <laughs> All right. Well, so maybe you can do a little bit of that Steve Warner song. At least I had the weekend. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, you want me to do that? Do that after Vegas, then y'all sweat. All right. All right. Let's see. Anybody else? Sorry. At least 20 dates. Lindsay was between us. There you go. That's <laughs> good. At least as she was right between us every day. Oh, every well, day. he loved you. Well, so can you, girl? He knew he had a package deal. That's the yeah. <laughs> well, he still he still was interested. So there yeah. you go. Okay, let's see. We are down to what are Misty. we down? We're Misty. Down to Misty. Oh, Misty, executive assistant, Cobb County. <laughs> She's single, she's looking. She's got on the shiniest boots I've ever seen. <laughs> Misty, this song is from 1961. I want to ask Kiki. Misty something first. You just messed up my intro. Go ahead. <laughs> you want to move to Chicago? Oh, well. I'm a southern girl, so yeah, I like southern. to move to Chicago. There is good pizza up there and stuff. So. All right, Miss Misty, you kick it off. Go ahead. Like a river flows surely to the sea, darling, so it goes. Some things are meant to be. I do. Take my hand, take my whole life to Alicia, Alicia. I know she had it. She Go ahead. I can't help falling in love with you, Elvis Presley. Good job, Misty. Give Alicia a prize. Okay, we have another special guest that's going to sing a song for you. You love him, you know him. He's one of the better singers of the church, for sure. Give him a hand, it's Mr. Owen.
Oh, and the crowd is going crazy for you. Son. Oh, Abby and Jerry. Okay, we'll we'll, we'll let that work out here in a minute then. And if you want to know the story on the pastor and his wife, they were killing guard with Cain and Abel. Oh no, I'm sorry. That was a joke. Come on in, pastor. Smelled something. Y'all eat? Oh, uh, no, no. Okay, I'm going to send these. Better get you some. You better load them. Yeah, we got a crowd. I got a piece. Is this on your own? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold it close to your mouth, though. I got a piece. That story about me and Barbara. All right, you want to finish? Finish. We've been on a blind date. <laughs> you knew it? You knew it? I didn't know I was going to go blind. But it turned out that way. Yeah. But turned into sweetheart with a new 48 year old. Yes, she did. Yeah, give my hand. Give her a hand for putting up with Mr. Owen. Keeping him straight. All right, Owen. 1968, open years and let's. What a fool I want to think I could get by. It only leads to me a few times I cried. I should have known the worst was yet to come. And they cried. Come on up, Miss Mary, and let's hear what you got for us. Come on up. Don't know. Yes. Don't you don't know your song. Get up here. Uh, uh, <laughs> She's Carolina Rain. Get her on up here. Y'all give her a hand and encourage her a little bit. You can do it. Is the mic on? When the night 
has come. Oh, yeah. And the land is dark. And the moon yeah. is the only light we have seen. No, I won't be afraid. Oh, I won't be afraid. Just as long as you stand. Uh, who's got it? Tim. Gloria. Somebody in your hand. Gloria. Nancy, go ahead, Gloria. I didn't give Nancy a present. She done got one. Go ahead, Nancy, do it. Stand by me, exactly. Give her a hand. You gonna finish it, Mary? Go ahead. Finish it out strong. Finish it strong. You stand. Stand by me. All right, don't hold back. There you go. Bye. Yeah, second verse, go ahead. Yeah, sing with her, come on. I won't cry, I won't cry, no, I won't shed a tear. Just as long as you stand by me. Yes, ma'am. Good job. Good job. That was a good job. Go ahead. All right. Give my mic. All right. Next, there's been a request again for the Hickory Groovers to come back up here. One more time. That's all right. 1972. Get your mind right around 1972. Yeah. That's fine. Who sings that song, Stand By Me? Stand By Me was Ben E. King. Yeah, yeah. All right. Hey, Tim. We all have pain. We all have sorrow. If we are wise, we know that there's always tomorrow. 